everybody and welcome back to another video of this challenge. I am super happy to play today because today we have the chance to play with a newborn baby. The newborn baby will be the second generation. Her name is Valentina and she represents the Rose generation. I will quickly read the bio of the Rose generation as it is published on little Simsy's Tumblr. You had everything you desired as a child, but you were always longing for more. As an adult, you have a hard time committing to relationships as you are so focused on your career. If we had a workaholic trait in The Sims 4, you would have it. You have absolutely no maternal instincts whatsoever, but you still love your child with all your heart. Her traits will be hot-headed, snob, romantic. Asp her aspiration will be serial romantic and her career will be politician. The rules are to have only one child, master the politician career and complete serial romantic aspiration, master charisma skill, leave someone at the altar, I think that would be very funny, and get married for the first time as an elder. So for now, all these rules and goals don't matter because Valentina is still a baby and also as a toddler, it won't really matter. Oh, she's crying. <laughs> It won't really matter for now, so we will try to raise her skills when she becomes a teenager and also start being romantic with other sims. For now, we will just offer her a perfect childhood and we will give her everything that she wants. Another thing that I want to mention in the beginning is that I've noticed that Minty the cat did not grow up she was oh my god look at her she's here <laughs> uh, uh, she did not grow up she was a kitten for more than three days and usually when you have a normal lifespan uh, cats and dogs they stay puppies and kittens only for three days what is she doing <laughs> all right we have to teach her to not sit on counters as I was saying, puppies and kittens stay only for three days, this small, and then they age up. But something happened and Minty the cat did not age up. So I had to cheat here a little bit. And now she's an adult. Look at her, she's so beautiful. Oh, what, oh, what happened? <laughs> yeah, good job, Minty. <laughs> she's so cute. She's really cute, even as an adult. Aww. Aww. I usually, when I play on my own and my sims watch a movie, I watch the movie with them. They are so well made and so funny. <laughs> this puppy lost his owner. Run, puppy! Run! <laughs> I'm so happy about Valentina. I really, I can't wait to play with her. All right, you know what? It's a beautiful day and I want Minty to raise her logic skill. So I will send her to the park at Willow Creek to play some chess. I renovated the park today before starting this Let's Play. So I'm really happy to show you how it is now. All right, and this is how I made the park. I really love it. It's so much full and it has so many activities to do here. Uh, I think that it, it's so much better than it was before. And I will definitely bring my Sims more often here. I uploaded it to my gallery and you can find it on Fru Fru Sims. It's here. It doesn't look as good right now because it's autumn and also it's cloudy. The weather is cloudy. But look at this park. Your children can come here and play. It's amazing. And also there is a place for toddlers to play. We will bring Valentina here when she's a toddler, definitely. 
there is a little florist shop over here and okay you know that your sims they cannot actually sell this but i placed this stand over here and if you have a sim that is uh, good at gardening they can make flowers here they can garden things here and they can sell them so it functions like this as a small uh, gardening shop <laughs> uh, here is a place for people to do some yoga uh, obviously we don't we cannot have picnics on the sims but i just placed these mats over here and you can pretend to have a picnic this is the central park with a fountain and around we have some chess tables. Oh, this doesn't work automatically. Oh, okay. Mm, that's weird. Okay, so you can hire a vendor here and well, I don't really like that. Do you know how this works? If we can make it work? Hmm. All right, so if you want to use these two, you can hire a vendor, but I will look if I can change it. And so we have vendors automatically, but I don't know if that works. And here are the toilets. It's nothing special. It's just a small building. Uh, also, this place is like this. Here we have the skating ring. Here we have a place for your Sims to make art and sell art and here we have the basketball court and this is not my idea i just saw somebody make put these basketballs in this basket yes and this is for your laundry i think it has laundry inside and i thought that this is very clever and i made the same and i put it here but this is not my idea and also usually in these kind of parks, uh, at least here in the Netherlands and in Cyprus, you also find some gym equipment and that's what I did. Oh, Julia, Julia is angry. Ooh, mm, maybe we can talk to her. Wait, oh my God. Ooh, yes, all right. Let's go there and be mean to her and Talk about what happened last time when she come at our place. Tell her that we didn't really appreciate that. Oh, and it's raining now. That's bad. Um, we don't have an umbrella, unfortunately. It's fine. Mm. Shout forbidden words. Just tell her how did she upset you. Oh, yeah. Ask what Julia's problem is. Yeah. What's your problem? Why you were flirting with my wife at my place? Oh, no. I wasn't doing that. <laughs> and then she looks at us like this. I really don't like you very much right now. Just feeling bitter over a few things that I will get over eventually or not. <gasps> what? Ooh. I, I knew that she's jealous. All right. So we will just pretend to say her, you know, you never talk with Becca again. We don't want you in our life. We have a baby right now and you better stay away from us. And then fight. Yeah, talk to the hand. <laughs> I really like that <laughs> when Sims do that. Maybe we can have a fight also so they become enemies. Fight. Let's see who will win. Minty is not athletic at all. <laughs> oh, fighting in public. There are children playing in the playground. Oh my god. She won. Alright, now they despise each other. Okay, so go away. Let's tell her to go away. Minty had a baby last night and today she's fighting with another sim <laughs> go away yeah she's gay <laughs> all right so we made our point here right minty <laughs> i wanted to come here and play with the chess so we get our logic skill higher but it started to rain i don't want to go home yet 
I will just wait until her logic skill goes up at least level, level 8 and then I will go home. This is Jeb Harris. He comes with the eco lifestyle pack. <laughs> he wears a bag over his head and he also holds an umbrella and he swings. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like this is so funny <laughs> and weird at the same time. So random. <laughs> Jeb Harris. He's actually really cute without this bag over his head. Oh, Paka, congratulations on the new addition to the family. Thank you so much. Oh, Becca has to go to work in one hour. All right, let's go home then. We cannot leave Valentina alone. Let's go home. She's hungry anyway, and it's raining, so yeah. Babies also grow in three days, so maybe we can also raise uh, Valentina at the end of this episode. But I won't rush. I will just uh, let it happen naturally. Again, she sits here all the time when she eats. <laughs> Let's go and talk to Valentina, play with her, cuddle. Let's have some quality time. Oh, that's so cute. That's really cute. I want to take a picture of it. So adorable. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so happy. Such a cutie. She's so happy. <laughs> Oh yeah, also let's give some uh, attention to Minty the cat. Yes, good job. I don't want her to feel that we ignore her because we had the baby. I wish I had a cat. I really miss having pets. I love cats and dogs and hamsters and any kind of pet you can imagine. I love all the animals and I wish I had a pet right now, but in this apartment it is not allowed and I really like the apartment, so I just moved in and I cannot move out again. Valentina is crying. Don't cry. Change dirty diaper. And then let's feed her. Remember the last time in the last episode, I've noticed a lot of people wearing this weird clothes. It's because they are tourists and they come from other worlds. So local people, they wear their normal clothing, but people from the other worlds, they, were, they wear this um, tourist outfit. <laughs> Took me a long time to figure that out. <laughs> oh, Becca comes home so late. It's fine. But she made some money. She brought home 198 simoleons. All right, I will put Becca to sleep and I will see you in the morning. Minty had to wake up very early because Valentina was crying and she needs to take care of her. It's almost Valentina's birthday. Yeah, babies grow up uh, really fast in this game. So maybe tomorrow we can age her up. Oh my god, they can, they can never use the dining area. They have to either go outside to eat or sit on the bed. That's, that's the, where they are eating. They can never sit on the dining area, never. <laughs> oh, Julia is a vendor here. Oh my god, like, I think Julia is spying on us. She's right outside of our house. She's a vendor right outside of our house. She chose this place to work. Maybe, maybe Minty will see her and be like, what are you doing here? Go away. I told you to stay away from my family. I told you to stay away from my place. <laughs> also freeze her now. Freeze her because she deserves that. 
<laughs> I'm so sorry, Becca. We're treating your best friend so badly. <laughs> but Minty really doesn't like her. <laughs> She's so happy that she froze her. <laughs> She's over there and Minty's so happy. <laughs> Freezing. <laughs> oh my god. That would be a great thumbnail. <laughs> Okay, and Becca doesn't know of all these things. I think we can pretend that Julia calls Becca and she tells her that Minty froze her right outside of their house while she was working. And maybe Minty and Becca can have a little fight. <laughs> but for now, uh, Becca knows nothing. All right, so it's Sunday and I think that's the perfect moment to send Minty somewhere else so she can find some more collectibles. I really want to finish that. I am trying to rebuild all the lots because I want to make my own save file. I prefer to play on my own uh, buildings or buildings of other people because usually simmers and I, <laughs> I am a simmer, uh, we make them look not so empty. So I'm trying to make that now as well. All right, we are done with this area. I will have her go. What? Look at Vladislaus. <laughs> Why is he dressed up as a bear? Okay. <laughs> yeah, we will go to another place now to collect. It's <laughs> there is a storm and I, I will just have her dig this one and then we will go someplace else. We will go to Oasis Springs. Recently I saw another save file and I don't remember who made it, but they made this place as a water park. And I think that this is so smart. I believe that I will make it also as a water park. It's unbelievable. I only found one place in this entire park. I only found one place to dig for collectibles. All right, I will go someplace else then. I can't get over that Vladislaus is wearing a pink bear costume. <laughs> Vladislaus, the evil vampire that everybody are scared of. <laughs> okay, let's go here. What? And it's snowing suddenly. <laughs> it's snowing. In Oasis Springs, it's snowing. <laughs> oh. Remember some episodes ago, I told you that it was so cold in the Netherlands that it snowed? Well, right now it's sunny. I'm not kidding. The weather changed in only one week. I'm not kidding. Like, imagine this weekend it's snowing and you can ice skate on the lakes and next weekend you wear t-shirts. <laughs> yes, this is Netherlands. The, the weather here is crazy. It, it can change immediately, so fast. And one thing that I noticed is that Dutch people really like talking about the weather because it's so crazy. <laughs> All right, thankfully I found more collectibles here. After that, I will go home because Becca has to go to work. There are so many people here. <laughs> All right, let's go home. Okay, we are back at home. She has found a lot of stuff, so I will just manage all this and I will see you. Okay, I sold a lot of stuff and I sent... Um, some metals and crystals to the geo cancel and we made quite a lot of money oh felix the ghost is back why you broke my oh come on felix 
Go make a cake. Why you broke my bus stop though? No, don't break my toilet. So annoying. Uh, and I cannot do anything about it. I will just use MC commands. He was just keep breaking everything. Oh, so annoying. It's fine when he just makes cakes, but I don't want him to break stuff. Oh, it's Valentina's birthday. The time just fl flies by, doesn't it? So cute. Well, we won't have a birthday cake or anything. It's, it's a baby. <laughs> she won't realize that. <laughs> uh, but I can wait to see how she looks like, you know? We used good genetics. Becca and Minty, they look really good. So I count on that. Who is this? Oh my god, Vicky! Vicky with a W! That's the girl that was running away on last episode. This, that's the girl that is on my thumbnail. <laughs> Why is she dressed like that? Oh my god. I love the Sims. I love the Sims. It's so random. Why is she dressed like a raccoon? <laughs> there is more! <laughs> Kazuri! <laughs> there is another raccoon! There is another raccoon! Are they gonna talk to each other? <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> Why we have raccoons walking around? Let's have some alone time with Becca. It's been a while. Ooh, 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 ooh. Um, yeah, we'll just press this and just go away. <laughs> is Valentina fine? Yes, she is. Is Minty fine? Yes, she is. Look at her. Oh, the more I see her, the more I want a cat. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> By the way, I was cooking some potatoes in the oven <laughs> before I started this let's play and they are ready now and I'm so hungry I want to eat but I will eat after I finish I will wait until uh, Valentina grows up and then I will finish this episode and I will go and eat oh <laughs> me tea <laughs> so cute <laughs> All right, so she's at work. I will skip the boring part and I will see you at the end of her shift. All right, guys, so this is the end of the shift. Uh, she didn't get any promotion. I think that she will get next uh, on her next shift. But it was just a normal <laughs> working day. Nothing really happened. I'm just waiting for Valentina to grow up. Our neighbors are woohooing <laughs> and they're making noise. Pound on door, Minty. <laughs> oh, Gita. Oh, and her son just arrived. <laughs> Oh, she was having woohoo with somebody while her son was at work and we ruined it. <laughs> Good. Complain aggringly about noise. We just had a baby and you're making these noises. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> Did she say something? Hey, I live here too. I'm sorry your life is boring. No, it's not. Maybe you should go to the lounge and have some fun of your own. How dare you? What's her name? Gita. How dare you? I wonder why they, are, they were annoyed. Because we only share this wall with this apartment. Only this wall. Yeah, this apartment is only this. And we share only this small wall with them. I don't understand why they were annoyed. 
All right, you know what? Let's woohoo with Becca and go to sleep. <laughs> and then um, I will see you when Valentina grows up and I will finish the episode. It's Valentina's birthday! Yay! All right, so Valentina aged up to, t to a toddler. All right, let's, let's randomize the traits. Or maybe... Yeah, because when she's a baby, it doesn't really matter for our challenge. Let's randomize it. Oh, she's silly, goofy and curious. These toddlers love to tell jokes and get playful. They earn imagination skills slightly faster. Such a cute sweetheart. Oh, look at her, Valentina. Oh, so she and she's hungry. Oh, she's hungry. She's hungry. <laughs> Let's feed her. All right, I, I want to change her appearance really fast before I finish the episode. Okay, everybody, so this is Valentina Berry. She will have the red color. And I saw other Let's Play. Some people choose the pink color, some people choose the red color. But I think because we will have a pink generation in the future, I will choose the red color for, for uh, Valentina. And for now, it's like a burgundy color. And I think it looks good on her. And as a toddler, I chose to have just brown hair. And when she grows up, then she will decide to paint them red when she becomes a teenager, actually. But for now, I will keep her hair brown. So this is her everyday outfit. I think it's really cute with the lady, ladybug shoes. This is her formal outfit. This is her sleepwear. This is her party outfit. This is her swimwear. So cute, so adorable sunglasses. <laughs> this is her hot weather outfit, again with the ladybug shoes. And this is her winter wear outfit. I love these sunglasses. <laughs> so this is Valentina Berry. And on the next episode, we will play with her as a toddler. Maybe we will take her to that park. I hope that the weather is good and she can play there. But for now, I think that this is it for this episode. We played a lot today. A lot of things happened again. I can't wait to play again. Thank you very much for seeing this episode. I really appreciate it. And I will see you next time. Bye.